Okay, we're going places. Hi. Um, we haven't done a vlog in a while and I've just got some running around to do. I rarely leave the house, so this is so exciting. I have to go get ant traps. Yeah. We have an ant situation. Um, ugh, it just drives me nuts. We have exterminators that come and they spray all around the house. We basically live in the woods, so, you know, there's all sorts of things. So, we... <laughs> We spray outside. So when we were, sp were spraying also inside when we first got the service, when we first moved to this house. However, I would wake up um, like the next morning with my lips really big. And I had no idea why, okay? It took maybe three of these times, you know, that this happened for me to put those two together, that that's what happened. So obviously I'm very allergic to something in the spray for creepy crawlies. So we can't spray in the house anymore or I'm a Kardashian. So uh, it's just, it's an interesting thing. So I've tried every kind of, um, for spiders too, cause we get wolf spiders, uh, especially in the fall. Sorry, my daughter just called. Um, we are doing all the natural remedies that I can find, all the concoctions, all the peppermint tea bags here and there for spiders and whatnot. So anyway, I have to find something that will work for ants. Um, I don't know what it's going to be either. So if you guys know any remedies that are all natural or, you know, shouldn't bother me or make my lips turn big, that'd be great. That help ants. So I am running to the post office. I believe I have something in my PO box and I am running to target. So I have a, just a list of things to do. Um, I'll be wearing my mask and going in and I don't go places. I don't leave the house. So it's, it's still scary for me to do that. It's weird. So anyway, that's what we're doing. So let's go do it. Oh, and I don't want to forget to tell you about the enormous hornet's nest that has been constructed outside my daughter's window. It's enormous, and that thing is uh, like super glued onto the house. I don't know what hornets do, but they, what they ever they create to create those those things. Oh my gosh, it is like stuck like glue. So we got half of it down. Bunch of swarms of hornets terrible mess. We are now working on the other part. I feel so bad for all the hornets, but I don't know what to do. I can't live with them. Um, but yeah, here's some pictures of the fun. Yeah. Isn't that gross? Ooh, ah. So anyway, we're dealing with that too. Darn it, it's not here yet. Maybe I'm just being impatient. I need to just calm down and wait, apparently. <laughs> All right, so I'm in, in the Target parking lot and I'm very excited because they are paving this parking lot. Finally, I'm telling you, you couldn't even get your cart to your car because the bumpity wumpity bumpities would like, half the things would fall out of the, it was terrible. So they're paving it, which means they're all shoved into this side of the parking lot. Um, but hey, I'm excited about it because good deal. So it looks kind of busy, which I didn't really want, but you know, ee. so let's go. Here we go. Look how fresh and clean this side is. They're working on that side over there.
smells like asphalt. Okay, I'm finally out of Target. It took way longer than I wanted it to. I only got about maybe half of the things I was looking for. But anyway, the good news is that I got a call from Claire while I was there and she dropped off Gracie at the house and I have Gracie this evening until about seven or eight or something, which is fabulous. So I'm gonna get home and we're gonna see little Gray Gray. check out the patio. It's the first thing she always wants to do. This little girl is so fun. She always checks out the garden. Oh. Is that a butterfly? Oh, there's the butterfly. He's back. What do you see? Good girl, you checked out the garden, didn't you, baby? Yeah, she's my good girl. Gracie's favorite place to sit is right there in the middle of the <laughs> of the plant. So here's some Gracie footage that I haven't shown and that you uh, haven't seen. <laughs> So the other thing that I have been working feverishly on is the Nordstrom anniversary sale, like picks and things that are just really, really good. So I went through it, every single page of all the categories except for kids and babies. I went through home and all the women's and even the men's. 
and I did find a few items in each category that I thought were must-haves, you know, you know what I mean by must-haves. Good, good items that, you know, could really work with for anybody pretty much in anyone's closet. So, I will definitely get that video out. I believe it will be up on Sunday. This coming Sunday, the, what is it? I don't even know. Ninth. I think it'll, that video will be up on the ninth. That's what I'm planning for anywhere. Anyway, but I'm working on it. I really like, you know, classics and those wardrobe staples kind of a thing. And I found some really good stuff. I'm happy about it. Yeah, that's gonna happen. I will talk to you guys soon. This has been fun. Have a good one. Bye.